That'll work. So he's gonna freaking yeet this thing out into the ocean. Oh, oh, oh dude, dude, dude. Do, 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 do. I'm here with my, my co-worker, my friend, Kyle Binion, and he decided to come with me after training today just to get out of the hotel and do something. But we went to a little bait store and I bought a dozen live shrimp and there just so happened to be two dudes cast netting for their own bait off of the dock and we got some live mullet. So that's, that's really what I came here, or not what I came here for, I came here for training, but that's what I was hoping to do is catch some of the mullet run. One of the local fishermen said that it's, it's really hot right now and it's going. I haven't seen any running, so I, I, you know, I don't know if I'm in the wrong spot or what, but at least we got two, two free ones. We're gonna live line them. We've been live lining them for about 20 minutes now. I haven't had any takes or anything, but he's lively on the hook, so that's good. So Kyle's gonna give it a send out there. Uh, you gotta watch the swivel. It's, yeah, it went past the islet. That'll work, so he's gonna, freaking yeet this thing out into the ocean. <laughs> Whatever yeet means. Hmm. What does yeet mean? On the website dailydot.com, they say, way back in 2008, an Urban Dictionary user said the yeet meaning is simply a way to express excitement, especially used in basketball when someone has shot a three-pointer that they are sure will go in the hoop or used in a colorful yet less wholesome context as one ejaculate. <laughs> what? There we go. And I'm gonna cast around some artificials, like some jerk baits, try some bucktails, and I'm gonna try a spoon right now. And uh, we're gonna see what happens. I'm gonna try that, so let's, let's do that. I'm gonna try to get some fresh water on these uh, shrimp and stuff real quick. Can you feel him? Is he there? Yeah, I can feel him. Okay, good. He's like kicking? Yeah. All right. Uh-uh, what? Are you kidding me? Okay. No, there's something. Uh-uh, no, uh, really? Yeah, if you feel him like going nuts, then you obviously know that something's chasing him. Let him swim around. Let's see, he's just live lining. We're just gonna let him swim, do his thing, and try to get chased by something. I'm gonna cast the spoon around. At least you can bomb it. Oh, dude, dude, dude. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. Bring, hey, careful, easy, easy, easy. I got something going off my reel. You got him? Yep. I'm coming, you got him? Oh, it's me. No, it's yes, it is. It was me. I think it was me the whole time. There's still something on there. Are you kidding me? No, there it is, there it is. You're right, you're right, you're right, you're right, you're right. Where is he? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, he's getting in the rocks. Come, come down here. You got it? I got it. Okay, follow him. I've got 40 pound fluorocarbon on there. The braid will cut it immediately. You gotta get down there closer. Come on. I'll give you the rod back if you want me to take it. There you go. Hold on. Where is he? Where is he? Okay. Is there drag going right now? Where is it? Coming back, it's in front of me now. I can't no, see any side, color. Side, okay. side, I can't side. see any color. Here he is, here he is, here Where? Okay. Yeah, it's a jack. Side. It's a jack. Yes. It's a jack creval. Dude, nice one. Right here, I got him. Oh shit. Is he kicking your ass or what, dude? I can't get him. It's okay. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on. Dude, are you are you joking? Look at that. Dude! <laughs> Listen to him grunting. Come here, dude. Do I have a red light on my GoPro? It's running. Okay, good. I think. Oh, it's him grunting. Yeah. That is crazy. Isn't it crazy? Is that his no normal noise that he's making? Or yeah. yeah. Is that, will he do that <laughs> underwater? Yeah. He's free. Dude. No, it's yours. It's your fish. I'll take a picture. I'll take it with mine and I'll send it to you. You got him? Careful with the gill rakers. They're sharp. Oh, sharp. <laughs> Dude, I cannot believe. How was the fight, man? Uh, it, was, it was a tough fight. Was it? Dude, are you kidding me? Should we Dude, him? yeah, sure. Just give him like a yeet down into the Just, nose dive. Yeah, we'll go down there. In the dress shoes. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> Full work attire. It's slippery down here. Dude, there he goes. 
perfect relief, dude. Yes! Yeah! Awesome! Yes! Yeah! Yeah! Awesome! Yes! Yeah! Awesome! Yeah! 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 Ew! <laughs> We're from Indiana. I'm not. I am not you. Kyle's from actually Georgia, uh, Georgia right? Yeah, that's where I came from. Is that where you came out? No, I came out in South Carolina. He came out in South Carolina, not out like out of the closet, but from the from the birthing canal. <laughs> the birthing canal. Yeah. Let's get another one on there, dude. Okay. So since that worked, let's first of all, yeah, we're gonna have to retie. It's okay though. It's a part of the process. Let's try to get one about 20 pounds heavier. Let me feel all the way up the line. I thought that, because you said you had one, it looked like it, the first yeah, effort. Yeah, as soon as, but, I, as soon as he went away, like I knew there was a fish on. But then I saw that your line was over the top of mine. And I kind of second guessed it, but as soon as your, your, your line came over the top, <laughs> it started going away again. So I had to take it back in. Hell yeah, dude. Oh, I wish I had grabbed more of those things, man. Damn it. I should have. I don't have room for them really though. Did they have any in the base store? Mm-mm. No? All she had was live. Oh, she did give me mud minnows though. But they're not they're not that size. They're just little minnows. I think we should be good here. Oh yeah, dude. I see that. Oh, oh you see he's lively too. You got some shrimp in there too. Yeah, shrimp. Okay, we're gonna hook in the same way. Okay, so I've got just a little recap. I've got 30 pound braid on a seven foot medium heavy freaking it's a pin pursuit. I bought it in Washington State when I lived there for a year caught my first lingcod on it and it did just fine but if we get something that takes a run like a heavy heavy run we're screwed so anyway we've got a 40 pound mono or a fluorocarbon leader with a barrel swivel and i think this is a six aught live bait hook ready you care if i get this one you've met your quota yeah. i'm excited dude that was, that i can't nice. believe it did you get pumped yeah, i got pumped, I got pumped. you got pumped too. <laughs> I'm surprised. Huh? Is that a fish right there? Huh? Right there? Where? Or a turtle. You see that? But, all right, he came up to the surface. There's a brown ball swimming right underneath the water. Uh -uh. He was underneath this little junk right here. And he started going down this way. My glasses aren't polarized. These are, I found them on the beach. Thumbs up for found glasses on the beach, guys. Dude, thumbs up and subscribe for that freaking fish, man. Woo! Killer. Let's call that one the Jack Attack. Jack Attack? Jack Attack. <laughs> Sounds good to me, man. Cuts us some incredible footage. <laughs> <laughs> Incredibles? Yeah, the, the little baby Jack Jack. That's what they called it? His, little, his name was Jack Jack. Oh, yeah. The, like, That's right, yep. I am an idiot. I'm so I'm so freaking pumped up right now. My heart is going... It might be a heart attack. I thought you were... It could be a heart attack. We did have some pretty gnarly barbecue today. And I'm in my mid-30s, so... No, I'm not. I'm in my early 30s. 33 is not mid. You're older than me. This is true. I look older. Do you? I don't think so. Look at the hair. I am so pumped right now. Dude, this is our only one left. Unless I can think of a rig to try to catch mullet myself. Cast which net. I don't have any. Yeah, I, well, there is one down there. I saw one when we were bringing your. Yeah. Did you see a cast net in that uh, little bait shop? I did, yeah. Did we go over there? They caught it right there off that They dock. did too. Yep. Like a dozen. I, there was more than that. More than a dozen. The, the birds took a dozen. That's right. And all you need buffet. Buffet. I thought for sure he was going to get you in the rocks and break you off. That scared me. That's crazy how they run stuff. Isn't it nuts? That little one I so caught when... Do they do that underwater too? That like I a, think so. Like it's their teeth in the back of their throat. The just grind of it? Yep. I'm going to bring this guy in. Terrible. I can't get any farther than that though. If I had a big old weight, but I don't think this rod can handle that. This is really not appropriate gear for what we're doing. It's good for jigging and stuff, but at least he's lively, man. I can feel him kicking hard. Right now I'm just free spooling. I'm just letting him take lines that go deeper. He's heading out for deeper water, so. <laughs> Dude, at the, at the moment that I thought it was my lure on your line, which it was, but I didn't think you, I thought you didn't have a fish. I was so heartbroken. <laughs> I was so upset. And then it was like, my emotions like from heartbroken to immediately stoked again in the blink of an eye. Okay, the fish, the mullet has really picked up some, some speed here. Oh yeah, yeah, okay. He's either getting chased, something's going on here. Okay, let's let him take some line. Yeah, he was really kicking there for a second.
All right, so just a little update real quick. At this point, I pulled the, I reeled the mullet in to make a make another cast, and it was gone. Or maybe Kyle did. I can't remember which which of us reeled it in, but the the mullet was gone. So we took another trip to the bait store to try to find a cast net, but we couldn't find one. So we went to another bait store. They didn't have a cast net either, so we ended up getting some other bait. If you've made it this far, kudos to you. Hit the subscribe button, please. Okay guys, so change of plan. Kyle and I went to go see if we could get a cast net, but the bait store where we were at earlier is closed and the other bait shop we went to didn't have them. So we bought some, uh, we were gonna try to catch some live bait since that's what we've caught fish on, but that didn't happen. So we opted for the next best thing, which was a frozen mullet. And we're gonna see if that works. Honestly, I don't, live bait is much better than this and even live bait. I just like fishing with artificial and lures, but, Sometimes that's what they want. I'm gonna stick this right here for a second and I'm gonna go see what the condition is of that uh, cast net. I'll be right back because I saw one down here. God damn. It's all caught up in there, dude. There's no way. There's no way I could get it out of the barnacles. All right, guys, I'm all by myself. Kyle had to go. So I'm just gonna toss around this jerk bait. I've got a live minnow out there. We'll see what that does. Try something different. All right guys, last ditch effort. Little bucktail with a paddle tail swim bait. It's about time to start heading in. Sun's down, we'll give it a couple more casts and see if we can do something with this. And then if not, gonna pack it in, head back to the, to the hotel. We didn't get skunk today. Kyle got on a freaking nice Jack Craval. Giant bait ball. Fish are busting right out there. Giant bait ball. There they go, they're diving, look at them. Something was chasing a man. Oh! That's it. Last cast. <sighs> Finally, that took forever. Thank you for stopping in, guys, and thank you for making it this far if you did. Kudos to you. If you haven't subscribed already, please hit that subscribe button. If you like this video, smiggity smash that like button. If you feel so inclined, please share this video with your friends and family and your neighbors and your grandmas and grandpas, your uncles, your aunts, all those good people. And uh, yeah, hit that subscribe button. Don't hit the subscribe button, man. You don't shut up, fish, man. This video suck. Yes, I do. No, you shut up, man. Yeah. You don't even know what you're doing half the time. Whatever, dude. Don't hit the subscribe button. You don't even know what you're talking about, man. Yeah, whatever. Hit that subscribe button for me. Thanks.